So we made it. We are here at Supreme Villas Hotel. They just picked us up. And we're checking in. Welcome letters, some maps, and some gifts. Thank you so much. Welcome. Tour of the apartment. Why not? Welcome to our crib. Nice little balcony. Let's see what kind of view this has. Oh man. Welcome to our crib. Package. Hello, Dylan and Quinn. Welcome to the Villa Supreme Hotel. We, then we've got these little cars. Is this a free haircut? <laughs> if this is a free haircut, that's exactly what I need right now. I mean it. We both kind of need it. Yeah, let's get started. So there you can see more kind of yeah. We've got We're at the tour of the hotel. Cool. It is absolutely hot as hell, but we got some uh, nice fish soup, fish and so far. It's pretty good. They've got different ones. I'm literally sweating right now. Good morning from a beautiful view of the forest. I feel so in touch with nature right now. About to go grab this breakfast. Found a nice place to set up. Some football. You ready? <laughs> Keep it going. Setting up the drone. This is pretty much paradise. Many have commented on how tan we've gotten. Well, here's some before and after for you. You know, the gringo glow. The name of this beach is? We don't give out the names of beaches Oh yeah, like this. no, never mind. This is a secret beach. When you give the information of everywhere, it becomes a ruin. So and look at how to nice. come to Brazil and find it yourself. Those people right there are the only other people that we've seen here. It's like it's gonna fight. Hold on, the GoPro super close, see what it does. He's like, fuck! <laughs> <laughs> 
So today we were supposed to go to a place called Marigoji and just woke up 6.30. We have to go take a bus and it is pouring rain. Now we don't know what to do. Apartment. <laughs> this shit looks so funny <laughs> from this side. Let me see what it looks like up. Like if <laughs> we, is, we is going to get some haircuts at the salon. We got these free coupons. Some coupons in Brazil. We're gonna go get these haircuts. We're gonna bring our for the free friend Felipe. He's gonna help make sure we don't get the fuck me ups. <laughs> our Uber driver is here, and it just started pouring. And we go. Dylan's going first. Finishing up right now. <laughs> Swish it up. Your turn. Yeah. haircut. <laughs> Way better. Amazing job. He did that. <laughs> now we don't have to go into Colombia looking homeless. <laughs> or into, or into, the, meeting. Or into the, the conference in Sao Paulo looking homeless, so we are definitely so thankful. We have an emergency in our apartment. <laughs> Show the vlogs right here. All these things. <laughs> Boom. Adios, fucker. Oh, bro. Jeez. We were deciding today to go to Marigoji and it, finally the sun came out yesterday, it was all storms. We finally go to order the Uber, no service, Wi-Fi completely cut out and we will literally get there with like seconds to spare at the bus station hoping that we can make it to Marigoji. If not, it will be a different beach I guess. be in the car when you get gas. After an hour of Ubering, I'm gonna go grab some acai, fix our addiction. And photo, tapioca, morango, si? Sí? Acai. Sí? Acai, sí? acai con uh, granola tradicional, uh, banana, been too long. Got some acai. We're at the beach. It's literally empty. We're gonna play some fuchi ball. Maybe get some surfing. We'll see. I haven't done it in like 10 years and Quinn has never done it. So we're going for 10, 10 kicks on the ball. We got this underwear style, Sunga. Save it.
guys, so we'll see if we get there. We are in some very small town. Just picked up like 10, 15 children. Off that bus, going with this guy. The, uh, the odds of anybody speaking English are negative 25. This guy is helping us out, making sure we don't get lost. So this has been quite an adventure. I would uh, like to point out that we thought this was just going to be a hop in a van and two hour ride and we arrive at the beach. Three different vehicles, three hours of travel at least. And people are helping us, thankfully, otherwise we'd be very lost. It's not bad at all. I think the other beaches we've been to are much prettier. So, lesson to be learned. Don't always trust Instagram, right? The internet in general. The water is beautiful with sunlight, but other than that, very unimpressed. And this was supposed to be one of the most beautiful places. If we think otherwise, sorry if we're insulting anybody's opinion. But we have uh, traveled four hours just for some acai. Right. is what we're most looking forward to at this point because the beach not so great time for some acai and maybe we will head back hola amigo que tal hola 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 <laughs> This is our last day here at Villa Supreme. We are off to San Paolo to grab our last breakfast here. We're gonna go eat, we're gonna jet on out and catch this flight. Let's go grab this breakfast real quick. Bananas! We're saying our farewells to the cooks in this place. They've been so nice. These were actually some of the nicest people that we've 
come across on this trip and honestly the whole staff in this hotel. I cannot say enough about everybody here at the Villa Supreme Hotel. So if you are ever in Maceo, Brazil, however unlikely that may be, definitely a must stay, quiet, away from the noise, away from the cities and <laughs> and it's a really beautiful place. The food is really good. The pool is beautiful. The views are beautiful. The staff is really like a family here. So definitely recommend it. And we are out waiting for this Uber. Off to the next airport, the next plane. Catch flights, not feeling. And we are off. I slept in another Uber. What is the count? <laughs> what is the count at? Should have been keeping track. I think we're at about 20 Ubers at least that I've slept in, so. Uh, when they tell you that you can only have one carry on or two. It's definitely not hidden, but... It's the best we can do. 